lady? That you? Shit. Thought you were gone. You're not alone in thinking me dead. Thought it was game over for me too. Things went ass up, huh? Not as planned. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. You know where she is? What I just say. Drop it. I won't tell you. Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? Hey, look. Hey, haven't I seen you here before? Got a good memory for faces. We're closed right now. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den? Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. Just don't let me catch you messing around, okay? Whoa, whoa. Start again. What is it you want to do? Beat some sense into him. That don't work. I don't know. Use lead. I, I don't care. I just want my room back. You pimping you out, that it? Told me I was generous. Where are you going? Nothing to see back Let here. Let it lie. Judy's friend. You done with that bagulho? Yep. Back to the bottom grind. Stop telling every joy toy you meet to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Sus, we're not done here. Oh, yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to each other. Moxes and nomads don't seem so different. Both seem to yammer a lot about community. Solidarity. Classic dilemma. What comes first? Family or the outside this world? This is a club. Nobody cares about your lofty world views. Listen, have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist? Need to find out who she was working for. That's it? That's it. Judy, you don't need to worry. I won't lay a hand on it. it wouldn't make sense. Fine. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Mega Tower. Luxurious. Wait. Um. Just let me know how she's doing. Okay. I'll give you a call. 
Okay? Thanks. Thank you, V. A doll. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram in a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? Don't you have somewhere to be? Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Nobody can hold a candle to Judy. She cuts virtues like they were diamonds. Damn straight. Jobs, call me. Name's V. And what? No, pleased to meet you? Hm. I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me. Kaku Akata, the Lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find a moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts for Sandra Dorset. You did quite well, you and that friend of yours. Until then. from the top. What's your name? Good, you ran a discount yesterday. Half price on everything. You're about to know my rent. So... for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. If I miss this time, enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Welcome to the N54 News. Our sock and the tiger claws are in bed Google. together. Go figure. From Every corp plays dirty, except the streets are more than that. They're filth. Emma 
So the corpse leave it to the gang. Suits collars and gets smart. Surprised? No, I mean, if Evelyn wanted to disappear, expect nanites that, when injected into the spinal cord, provide long-term unprotected repair to the neural tissue. So hold on. You take a blow-up doll, remodel the hole, and, and that's cheap. That's the infidelity. Uh, no. Well, how's that any different from some dollhouse ass? Because the ass is meat, not latex. That's so hard to understand. Meat, right. No feeling going on, no thinking, no awareness. It's empty. Might as well be latex. Masturbation, sophisticated kind. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? You realize personal links aren't secure, right? Could get hit with malware straight to my core, end up paying an arm and a leg for a ripper dock. We need data from your core to pair you up with the doll. Meaning a biometric scan? Just that. If anything goes wrong, you can lodge a complaint. But that's never happened. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Afterlife. And saved. Now, bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. matches interesting is that normal or who can say what is normal you're clearly a unique person with unique tastes our system can handle it so who will it be angel or sky rather go with sky i couldn't have chosen better myself now for the payment and you'll venture into the clouds. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> We have a strict no-weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Go eat a dick, Johnny. We hope you enjoy your stay. That. Hi, I'm Sky, and you must be Vincent. Welp, looks like this will be interesting. 
So, V, you're dying. How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside, you fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. Think you know me well? Okay. Tell me what I'm so afraid of. It's something you don't talk about. Everybody's entitled to secrets. Got my own with good reason, too. Say it. Say it out loud. Not for me, but for yourself. Had a true friend once. Now he's gone. Soon I'll be gone too. Except, won't have anyone by my side. Everything you need, you already carry inside you. You're scared, because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know that I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? The people I've lost live on in my thoughts. And that's what I'll be. A memory. Or just an annoying little voice in someone else's head. You don't see death as destruction. The end. But as a change, that thought alone could save your life. I'm afraid of becoming someone else. Forgetting who I am. You're already becoming someone else. Every second of every day. Still, I feel... a connection between who I was and who I'm turning into. What you really fear... is becoming someone you don't recognize in the least. <sighs> so what now? Tell me. You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should have, you go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action, going where you needed to go. And it won't stop you. How do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Thanks, uh... For all this... Jeez... Don't even feel like getting up. Few do. But everything has its end. Afterlife. What's going on? Goddamn thing.
thing threw me out. I need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake. Ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? A lot of things been going on in my head lately. This was... different. Refreshing. That's what we do at Clouds. I get why people come here. Come back. But I need something else. Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. You gotta help me. Please. I'm no threat, but she could be in trouble. Just wanna talk to her, find out if she's okay. In case you haven't noticed, doll work's not the most secure job in the world. One day you're in, the next you're out. And maybe gone. Anything out of the ordinary happened here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think, an XBD star? Where will I find him? VIP area, booth two, I think. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all. Let's take a look, shall Blood. we? Fresh, not too much. Put it to a wound rather than a kill. Oh, what's this? Well, client wasn't the one who flew off the handle. Something bitter in the ass. What do you think? Cyberpsychosis? Sounds crazy, but she could have been remotely hacked. And that runner? Weird. See that? See what? Nothing there. Exactly. There should be a port right there for the doll to jack into. They rip it out? Wonder why. Not bad, but it would be much better. I can't get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week! You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am! No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog! I'm taking it up with you, here, now! You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? This conk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. 
From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. I'll see. You're going back upstairs? In a minute. Need to piss first. Huh. What will you have? Anything. Whatever stands to fuck me up the quickest. You better keep this short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day. Hi! Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure, uh... I don't have your details? Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. I need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. You mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so... I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest, then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges and these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. Of 
Yeah, I have that bike. I know where it. Have you ever heard of Jotaro Shobo? He's one of the key claws. Yeah, I've heard. A fucking psycho. Likes to hurt people. The mocks have him on their blacklist. Some girls marked him for death. That's all pudding, honey. But so what? Hold it there, honey. You seem to be in the wrong place. Hey, no peeking. Bad luck sings like this. Looks familiar. What's that? Evelyn's jacket. It's crumpled like a tissue. It must have been here a while. Hey, did you not hear? I'm calling security. Tiger Claw's moonlight is peeping Tom's. They always got eyes in their dolls. Know what goes on in these boots. Then, data mine the behavioral chips. Saw that twist coming a mile away. Had a hunch. Still, wonder if it's for the... Something sp... Spooked him. Right there, see that? 2 a.m. they hauled every last security man to the club. Looks like they called Tiger Claw's for backup, too. Clients allowed in here. Be a chum and close the door on your way out, would ya? Or as you can see, I'm very busy. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Ah. You could do better. Try Roxy over at Booth too. Same heart-shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. Looked to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho prick who's never been ghosted by his bow or bill before. But go on. I'm listening. No, you guys got hit by a runner a while back. I can make sure that never happens again. That's so. Uh, let's hear it then. Tit for tat. Wanna be net secure? You're gonna help me find Evelyn first. That's the only way this is gonna work. All right, fine. I'll lay it on you straight. Girl you're looking for, Parker. She ain't here. Tell me something I don't know. Like, where is she? Think you know how things work around here. But you don't know shit. Dolls aren't here to give you pleasure and satisfaction out of the goodness of their soul. They're workers. 
Their jobs to generate profit. Is this you talking it out straight? What happened to Evelyn? Got an order from up high to recycle her. You killed her? No. I found a ripper doc who was willing to take a look. Yeah, said he knew something or other. You took her to the Ripper instead of following orders. Didn't take you for someone with balls. For fuck's sake, I'm not running a slaughterhouse here. I only recycle as a last resort. And family always gets a call. If there is any. Think there are any daddies out there willing to change the diapers of a brain-dead little slut on the verge of cyberpsychosis? Probably not. Casting him out on the street ain't an option either. Can't risk tanking our crib. Well, anything's better than a bullet to the brain. <laughs> you know, that's what every doll says. I'm starting to like you. You looking for work by any chance? The Ripper. Name and address. Don't know a last day. Don't fuck with me. I'm not. Goes by fingers. Clinic's in some godforsaken alley up on Jig Jig Street. Wanna find Evelyn? Look there. Now, you do your end. How do we board up against hacks? You need soft to lice like chip and implant receptor layers from Cloud's subnet. At the same time, we'll keep track of and block any attempts to modify the core on the go. Uh, now in human rather than machine. You need Smart Eye, latest version. Smart Eye. Got it. Don't come back here. Ever. While you're at it, take the elevator. The quicker you're out of here, the better. Dark fingers on Chig Chig Street. Sounds like a co ed's wet dream. Gotta go. charm this place in that slimy subterranean kind of way you think fingers got her I think we'll find her there V if I could see that far I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now see your opinion about dollhouses has changed oh but it has before I wouldn't have touched one with a 10 mile pole now I'm thinking a fire would really make this place shine 